Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hi, this is Ghufran. In this video, you will learn how to get data from MS Access database using PHP. So let's start. This is my database. Uh, I'm opening it. Okay. Here, all the tables are displayed. So I want to get data from one of these tables. For example, user info is my table. Okay, good. So uh, I will make a file. Let's make a file. Notepad. Open it. That's good. Make a PHP tags. Save it. I want to save into the ZAM directory. docs Projects. Get data. This is my file path. So I am naming it this index.php. Okay, good. So let's find out the uh, path of this database. Control, right click, properties. So this is the path. Copied it insert okay this is my dollar db good and what's the name of this database so in the name of this database is copied it and paste it dot mdb so i am here i will apply a check if if not file underscore exist dollar db so die it could not find database file or else echo database loaded successfully Let's try it. I will open it. Get data. Database loaded successfully. So I have loaded successfully my database. If I'm change or change in the path, so what will be the result? Could not find database. So we have successfully loaded our database. That's good. Okay, my database is loaded successfully. So now I will apply a query and for this I will need a PDO extension so dollar DB new PDO bracket open bracket close so we call in ODBC driver okay equal Microsoft access driver static dot mdb okay that's great semicolon dbq equal to my db name that is dollar db uid user id that is empty password equal that is empty that's great so next let's try it into my browser oh it's appear a fatal error so my pdo extension is not enabled from php.ni so how to enable uh, and how to remove this error so i will go to my sam php here i will open a php.ini file open it edit it with notepad okay let's find a pdo so here are a pdo extension so uncomment it pdo pdo uncomment it sorry that's pdo let's uh, restart the php uh, server apache stop it and then you will restart it again I start it now load it so the error is removed okay okay my connection is step is successfully established so I will create a query now dollar SQL what is my table name my table name is user info that's good 
select static from user info that's good okay a dollar result equal dollar db query dollar xql so let's find out that uh, is there any results coming echo pre and print all it print the airway dollar result fetch all and die. let's try it that's great my all the data in the access table have been fetched that's great so all the data have been fetched now i want to display this array into a table so it's a simple so i will comment it okay that's great table sorry table table okay tr tr and th table header my first column is user id and account number and ssn and name so here i will apply a for each to for each dollar result fetch all is dollar key dollar row that's good so just copy this tr that's good and php tag echo dollar row that's my user id okay and another one is badge number badge number paste it another one is ssn paste it another one is name paste it let's check it into my browser that's great this is my data and we have successfully get data from ms access table using php so please subscribe our youtube channel for more informative videos thank you very much